The CW Network has appeared to have a treat in store for Vampire Diaries and Riverdale fans. A star from the show's Vampire Diaries and Riverdale was tagged to be involved in respective new projects on the CW. The production of two new programs on the network is set to occur in the near future. Following the CW being acquired by Next Star in 2022, TV Line reported on Thursday. CW announced that the series Wild Cards and Sight Unseen have been greenlit. The news outlet explained. Wild Cards, which is outlined as a crime-solving procedural with a comedic twist, will star Riverdale alum Vanessa Morgan, 31, and Grey's Anatomy actor Giacomo Giniotti, 34. Meanwhile, Sight Unseen, which will focus on a homicide detective who had to quit the police force after almost killing her partner, stars Vampire Diaries' notable Daniel Gillies, 47. Also starring in Sight Unseen will be budding television actress Dolly Lewis. Fans took to X, formerly known as Twitter, to share their reaction to learning that the CW is planning to bring back two beloved actors to the network. Daniel Gillies on the CW again, about to pay for cable to see this law, one fan tweeted. Another added, oh, I am somewhat surprised by this news. A third person admitted, now you know I'm going to watch anything Vanessa Morgan is in or at least give it a try. CW's changes. The CW has been shaking up its content for viewers. At the end of September, the Miss USA pageant was aired on the network. The last time the pageant was on TV, it aired for one year on Fox in 2016. Before his presidential run in 2016, Donald Trump, 77, owned the Miss USA pageant as the show aired on NBC from 1996 to 2015. In 2015, WME, IMG purchased the pageant from Trump. In 2022, the pageant was sold again, this time to JKN Global Group. That same year, Miss USA aired on FYI Network and Hulu Live TV. President and CEO of the Miss USA and Teen USA organization Layla Rose said in a statement, We are eagerly anticipating the opportunity to present viewers with a modern and progressive approach to a 70-year-old tradition, and we're looking forward to the moment when this year's deserving champions are crowned. Heather Allender, the head of unscripted content at the CW, also added a statement, The Miss USA pageant and Miss Teen USA pageants are time-honored traditions. We are thrilled to be collaborating with Layla Rose and Renato Bazal for what is sure to be a night of exciting entertainment. This year, the event took place at the Grand Sierra Resort in Reno, Nevada, cutting ties. Though the CW is expanding its show lineup, it's also giving some shows the boot. Head honchos at the CW pulled the plug on their show Barons in June, right in the middle of its season. The Australian surfing drama was included in the CW's primetime schedule, but after just four episodes, that came to a screeching halt, TV Line reported. Reruns of the mystery drama Nancy Drew will be given Barons 9 divided by 8 C time slot, the news publication added. Barron's debuted in Australia last year before it began airing on the CW in May. When the series premiered in America, it brought in 179,000 total viewers and earned a 0.0 rating TV line outline. It has been a downward spiral since then, with viewership taking a massive dip at one point.